Good morning, afternoon, and evening, everyone. This is Hippie Tesla, and we're doing episode four of the original Resident Evil, not the director's cut. I can't stress that enough. This is the original version. No auto aim, balls to the wall. It's fucking hard, especially when the hunters came. I I knew that was gonna be the case. So last time, I needed a good shower after playing this, cause those hunters really, really, really scared the shit out of me for some reason. They're not. They're scarier than the remake hunters, just because the remake hunters just sound like overgrown frogs. They just make this like blah 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 blah, blah sound. Well, these are fucking brutal, and you can't just aim at them. They can jump over grenades, stuff like that. So this is where I kind of got stuck. Uh, basically, because there are two hunters waiting for me behind the door where I need to pass. And that's not something I'm happy about, you know, so I'm not happy about facing those bricks, so... <sighs> I just saved, I mean, I, I'm at the save point, so it's not that scary, but still, it's fucking stressful. You, you can just hear their footsteps, okay, be quiet, everyone. Fucking assholes. I'll get you. Okay, one wasted, one wasted grenade, but I'm alive, and that's what matters. I can probably reload the save and do this with, uh, keep another grenade, but let's try, because I'm pretty sure there's a boss right after this, like a huge fucking spider. And I wouldn't even have to fight these two hunters had I just picked up the crank when, uh, what was his name? Roberto? No. Enrico? Enrico's was, eye was poked by a giant rubber band, but I had no space in my inventory, and then when I came back, two more hunters were there. Just hurry, hurry, we don't know if there are any more. So we got another crank, we're making quite a crank collection here. And if we take a look at this one, Ta-da! Hex-shaped, okay. So we have a hex crank now, and we have a square crank. We're gonna need, I think we're gonna need both, but for now we need the hex one to just make a bridge, tunnel, whatever. There's a gaping hole up ahead, and I just need to pass it, and I need a crank for that. It was right where I saved, next to the typewriter. Oh boy. It is scary where you can't see where they are. Is it here? Yeah. See if I hadn't if I hadn't let that one guy uh, if I hadn't let him jump. Thanks for the auto host team. If I hadn't let him jump, I could have just like just hit him with a grenade straight away, but I wasn't quick enough. And they are building pressure in my head, so jeez hunters. They're my favorite and my most hated enemy from the original Resident Evil. Spin, spin that crank, Jill. Yeah, we're gonna have to watch through the entirety of the process for some reason. They could have just skipped that part, but no. Look at her, spin that crank. Do you spin a crank? Do you push it? What do you do? Turn, turn the crank, yeah. Crank it up, Jill. Okay. Bazooka in this version is the only weapon I actually care about. Now, you know, with the auto aim, you can do a lot with shotgun. But uh, in this version, it's mainly for zombies and Cerberi. You can't really, hunters don't really give a fuck about it. Oh, I think this is where Chris would find a flamethrower. But don't hold me to it. Do I wanna. Oh, God. Can I turn? I'm gonna go backwards. Fuck that. One. What, nothing? Now I run? Oh, okay, yeah. So it's at least fair if I'm gonna be turned in the right direction if that happens. But wait, that's not all. You can't get it in any store. What an ineffective trap. So you, you can trigger it once and there you have... It's, it's fucked up forever. <laughs> now this music. 
If I remember correctly, there's gonna be a hunter somewhere around here. Another one, because why not? Oh, uh, Barry? No, it's a hunter. Of course it's not Barry. Fuck that guy, Jill. Just kind of fucking ignore him. He's not worth your time. And I have just one health. Oh, lovely. No, I, when I started doing this, I didn't expect it to be as abysmal. Come here, buddy. Come to my bazooka. Aim. He's just going slowly. He doesn't care. He's like, yeah, I'm gonna get you, Jill. Ah, uh, hello, cha. Stand up and I'll. Oh. How did it miss? How did it miss? Okay. Are you fucking kidding me? No, I'm not wasting another bazooka on you, asshole. Oh god, it's two wasted bazooka rounds. I'm just it just hurts me how many rounds I've wasted in this game. So I we can just hope that this is enough for for the spider, because otherwise, well, that's all we have. I mean I can repeat that last save. Definitely, but maybe I should talk less and play more. Maybe that'll help. No hunters here. Okay, it's giant torrential time. These are the doors that take me to it, I think. And I guess even without auto aim, it should be easy to hit. F giant fucking yeah, that's giant fucking spiders and snakes and whatnot. Ah! Fuck you, buddy. That took his its legs off. Hopefully, it doesn't mortally poison me. Burn it! Burn it with fire. Ah, oh, missed. Yeah, I'm dead. Missed twice. Wow. Okay, at least maybe I saved some ammo on those two hunters. At least now, now I know what's waiting for me and how to deal with it. Jesus, yeah, I'm dead. Thanks, game. It's not traumatizing at all. Fuck. God. You really fucked us over without, with the whole no auto aim thing. It's just... <laughs> Yeah, I can't. I keep repeating that, but it's so not fair. It is a Resident Evil. You're right, narrator person. Okay. It's not too bad. Actually, glad I saved there before facing the giant ass spider. Whew. So, let's try and be smarter with the hunters. The key is to hit him. Hit it, whatever as soon as it starts getting up because if you don't it just jumps at you and can if it swipes at your head maybe i can just run past them i don't know i don't know if that's a good strategy never mind i got nerves of steel kinda look at him he's not even scared all right boat oh fuck that um no not I'm gonna reset it. Nope, I'm not taking that for an answer. That is so not fair. Shit, fuck, ass, bitch, motherfucker. Evil. One more time. <laughs> yeah, they're not gonna get uh, get the best of me. Oh man. Cause I can reload my save. They can't. Once I'm done with them, that's it. They're done. Good luck. Yeah, I'll need a lot of luck here. Come on, Jill. You have a bazooka. They're just two green gorillas without skin. How scary can they can they be? Just clip their nails and you're done with it. Take him to a dentist. That's it. Uh, I'm glad I saved here. I am. I will repeat that five thousand fucking times. Fuck you and fuck you and you fuck you as well. And you. Fuck yeah. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Uh. Do I want to waste these on the spider? Yeah, actually, why not? They're the worst rounds. And I have two sp slots now, so why not? Okay, that wasn't bad. That wasn't bad. It's better than last time. I'm sure we're going to do better at Spider as well. It killed me so fast though, did you see that? Like two spits and I was like, Bleh. Ah, another hunter. Fuck that guy. Fuck all hunters. <sighs> so stressful. 
Okay, okay, okay. There's a crank. Yes. Crank it up. Should I use another ink ribbon and save or just be dumb and brave at the same time and just try to beat the game with the least possible amount of saves? And does it even matter? Will somebody sometime in the future be like, yeah, that's the guy who beat Resident Evil with minimum possible saves for his skill <sighs> without all the aim. I'll never let it go. It's not fair. It actually feels most like Resident Evil 7 in terms of how underpowered you are. Even in that game you can like you can turn at least, like do a quick turn or you can hide, you can Yeah, you can block, yeah. Thanks, nephew. You can block, yeah. Here you can just like watch him wail on you. Just it's not fair. But I love it. Does that make me a masochist? I don't want to answer that question. I don't want the answer to that question, though. <laughs> yeah, 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 spin the crank. Can I skip this? No. The thing to reset the game without resetting the console, you have to push and hold, start and select at the same time for, I think, three, five seconds. Which, it happened to me once when I was trying to skip a cutscene and I was nervous or something. I was like, and I managed to reset the whole game. <laughs> okay, we know there's gonna be a hunter there. We know we can save, but fuck that. I don't know who I'm saving these ink ribbons for. It's not like I'm gonna come back to this game. I'm gonna get me a director's cut version and just be like, ah, oh, this is so relaxing. Run, Jill! Oh, yeah. First death. Okay. First I touch the rock and be like, oh, well, there's nothing to do here, whatever. In the place, you know, I just start running here. And oh my god, it's moving! Oh, the humanity! Who puts sentient rocks as traps? This is just insane! Fuck, fuck, fuck! I think there's another rock trap up ahead, right? I kind of feel there is. And more hunters, probably. Oh, to hell with them. So can I kill a hunter with two grenades? I should be able to. No, don't stand there, move, he's coming closer, for fuck's sake, Jill. It's like, at some points the game is like, yeah, you see this immediate danger? Just look at it for a while while it approaches you. It's, uh, it's not too bad, you know? So he shouldn't be able to get to me from over here, but you, you never know with this game. Come on, Hunter. Come on. Let's be quiet. Damn you. Yeah, fuck you, buddy. Yeah, he lost his hands. I don't I do not regret losing that one. Uh grenade. Yeah. Okay, three here. Just fire at the spider. Don't let him breed. Don't. I don't think there's any point in moving, honestly, but, you know, I might be wrong. And the music's not tense at all, like, wow, it's so relaxing. Fuck you! No! Poison and danger at the same time, wow. He's not fucking around. Wow, that actually cured everything, yeah! Just burn him and he's dead, she's dead, whatever. No, yo. Is this possible? Is this even. I don't remember it being this hard. Like, you just like fire a few grenades at it and it's like, bleh. One more time. This time I'm gonna save if I successfully kill those hunters. Because this is. This is getting hard. Like, in, in the beginning I was like, yeah, this is not too bad. And then I was like, yeah, it's okay. I have the shotgun. And then hunters came and I was like, ah! Shouldn't be this stressful. <laughs> okay. This is take four, everyone. Back to their places, I guess. Oh. It is a world of survival horror. They're not really 
survival horror at like the core of survival horror. I don't even know. I just hear ow, ow. Those are hunter sounds, by the way. I'm making ten grenades. How did it kill me so fast? I was like fine, and then puked like three times in a row. Okay, if these guys fall quickly, I just go back for more health and save. One down. Yeah! 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 That was good. Okay, Jill. All's forgiven. Here we go. Bring more health. No fucking around. Bring more health. I wonder how long would it take for Chris to die with his, like he's the master of taking a beating. So I wonder if like, if he could survive the spider better. Survive him better? <laughs> if he'd have an easier time of surviving the giant tarantula of death. And the giant snake of death, and the giant shark of death, and the giant fucking plant of death. Like where, where's the giant mosquito of death, I wonder. Woohoo! Okay, here we go. Yeah, I hear you, buddy. I'm not going there. You can't lure me with your promises of candy and flowers. I know what you're all about. You have long nails and want to scratch me. And I do not like that. The scary door is being opened, taking us to a new realm of Scariness. Yeah, yeah, climb the ladder. Oh. All the way back to the house. I mean, there's no enemies on the way, at least. That's really good. And the crickets and dogs are relaxing. My favorite part of the game, so... It's not that bad. Mass Effect elevators as well. Look at him go. Not, it doesn't even have music like in Mass Effect. That's the <laughs> that's the tallest fucking floor in existence of like garden floors. What's the point of this? Again, I'm asking questions that probably no one can answer. Well, what's the point of this here? Like, what do you do if you're living here? Look, we have a gate and some flowers. Whoop de doo. Where are the chairs? Like coffee tables, things like that that you can be like. Yeah, look at my house. I have fucking mutated Doberman, Dobermans, Dobermans. I have a shark somewhere and a giant snake and a spider, but you can relax and have some coffee here. No, they didn't even have the courtesy to leave the coffee table out. Just like spiders and snakes, infected personnel. I'm really glad that hunters only open doors uh, in cutscenes, because otherwise I'd be in a world of shit. Zombies too, yeah. But in the remake, they actually open doors. I mean, in certain situations, but yeah, sometimes you hear a doorknob rumbling and you're like, what's that? And then you find yourself face to face with a zombie. Uh, sometimes even a crimson head. And I think even hunters do that. Okay, so we want, we have, uh, what's this? I think it's two blue and so we need more blue herbs. Which I didn't bring enough because I was like, yeah, I'll never need blue herbs. I never get poisoned. Didn't count in the fact that I can't aim at stuff. It's a mixture of two green herbs. Okay, two green. And here, so I gotta be, I gotta check my health often. That's the main thing. Here we have two green and blue. Herb. Yeah, that's what I'm gonna do here as well. So. Let's OCD this shit. So that, then bazooka, then that, then that, that. But then we need a blue herb, which only three left. God, that's oh, that makes it only two left. I wish I wasn't so wasteful with them. I hope I'll find more. 
That's not bad. Okay. Two mega healths that remove poison. Maybe it just maybe the poison is, you know, like what's the word that I'm looking for? Incremental? Like the more it spits at you, the more it poisons you and the faster it drains your health, something like that. I mean, I, I always wondered why they even bothered to include the giant spider when it's so easily defeated. Like Garland from Final Fantasy. But apparently not always. Okay, I have the bazooka, the shells. I'm back for you, spider fucking bitch. You know, that's not really good, because now I can't... I have to leave something. I'm gonna leave the square crank. I'm sure I'll need it later, but I'm also sure there'll be a an item box. And the point is I need to pick up the fire shells, which I won't be able to do without this. So crank, lighter, lighter, mode disc. We need another crank space, then the lighter space, then the mode disc space, then take the crank, hex crank. And now we're ready to roll, are we? Yeah, if I save. Yeah, that's it. Okay. How would you do this with Chris? Like, what? Would you stab the spider until it gives up? There's a knife in that room, which we'll need. So I'm not gonna bring my own. But I really wonder what, like, what would you do? Like, just take the knife and stab it? I gotta say, this is kind of defeating, but I never lost to that spider. Especially not twice in a row. I wonder what's the tyrant going to do, is he going to spit acid shit at me too? But we've taken on a gigantic task and we have to see it through. We have to, I have to do it. I have to. What to do? Was it the remake where Barry leaves stuff in the in this room instead of the the was it the eastern room? God, yeah, it's the eastern room. No, that's not the, the map I'm looking for. I think it's that that's in the remake, but I'm not entirely sure. Goodbye, ground floor. Hello, basement, cave floor. Now, what would be funny if I do this like a few times, relax, and then suddenly they throw a hunter or a Cerberus at me. Or a couple. It's not beneath this game. There's a ladder that obviously we couldn't access while the water was running because it's a water of steel. I have the crank. Should have turned the crank and left it. God, never mind. So, to save us all some time, because I seem to fail at this part miserably, I'm gonna turn the crank. What do you mean? You were just saying it needs a hex thing. Okay. Turn the crank, save, and then go face the spider and the hunter. And if we're lucky, that's the only time I'll do that. Come on. It's almost there. Ah, oh, Jill. Ah. Oh. Here we go. Yes, that's my inventory. It's very lovely. Let's save again. Same spot. Shameful. Shameful. All right, all right, the shame of a save. Okay, now we have a secure checkpoint. We go through the scary door, face the rolling rock of death. I think you can just name everything in this game, be like, 
the thing of death, hunters of death, snakes of death, rocks of death, the zook of death. Zombies are of death, obviously, but then we have... Ah! It's gonna squish me. Why does she kneel? Like, how does that help? Did it knock her off her, he off her feet? Like, what? And this music is so weird. I don't think it appeared maybe once, twice maybe. Hello, hunter. It's not like you're invisible. Is there, will there be another hunter that opens doors? Because that would be just... I don't want to see that. I don't want a world where hunters open doors freely. It's not fair. If they can open doors, I must be able to auto-aim. He's gonna see me? Fuck you, buddy. Get up, get up. Yeah, you missed me. Yeah, just patience. That's all I need. So, four more explosive, six flame. Save again, maybe? <laughs> six flame rounds. And the giant fucking spider is dead. There's something here, maybe. No, it's just a rock. Just be mindful of health. I don't think there's any point in me moving. Just gonna waste time because the spider can auto aim and also strafe dodge and I can just look at it and be like, ah, help God. Hit me twice and I'm already danger. Wow, that's so unfair. One more. Fine for now. Okay, I can survive this just a bit more. Yeah! Fuck you, spider of that! Fuck you! Who's the master now? Oh, master of unlocking and spider killing. Shit ass bitch. Oh, I feel so fulfilled now. Fuck you. It's gonna... A lot of babies are gonna run out of it right now. So... I'm just gonna show you that and then run for my life. It's gonna explode or something like that. Here we go. And here they go. Here they go. Ah, they're so scary. <laughs> Thousand little baby spiders coming at me. Okay, after this part, I believe, I believe everything's gonna be fine. It's gonna be fine. And I'm just, I just hope as soon as I say that the hunter doesn't walk away with my head. Because that would be... Would that be ironic? I'm not sure. Maybe we should ask the red versus blue cast. And five flame rounds left. Okay. It's good that I died several times. Stab that spider web. Uh. Mm. Fuck you. And you. Fuck. Ass. Bitch. Uh. There we go. And that's the last I'll ever need that knife. Oh god, didn't even need a second health. That's so good. Any ammo? <laughs> I love the how the cobweb sounds when you walk on it. But if there's something here. Shotgun shells maybe. I would I could use some shotgun shells or grenade rounds. I'm walking on icky stuff. What did that spider do here? Sounds like it was naughty. I mean, it was alone in the dark. Ah, there we go. There's something. Well, that's the thing I need the least, but I'm not going to be ungrateful. It's the same barrels that were at uh, at Yon's attic room. So maybe, maybe it's the barrels that fuck up these animals or insects and lizards, whatever. Maybe it's like there's something in the barrels. Bad water, bad whiskey. Who knows? Nothing else, okay. Please God, let it be no hunters there. Please God, no hunters. Please God, no hunters. No hunters! I've seen enough hunters, I love them, but I've had enough of them. I don't hear anything. There are two rooms. Huh, lovely. Okay, where do I go? I kind of remember this part, but the keyword is kinda. Oh, look, I, I think I can... Is that a shortcut I can open? No? Maybe? I have no idea. But I have to try! Something here? No? 
Oh, it's a save room. Yeah, it's a save room. Oh, more ink ribbon. I can spend all the ink ribbon. Nobody cares what my grade is. It's just my foolish pride. You can save your... Pr no, no, I don't want to save. Let me open the box. What's in the box? I go with the mystery box. Oh, more herbs. Thank you, kind god of blue herbs. I will never underestimate you again. I promise. I was wrong. I was wrong all this time. Okay. Lovely blue herbs. I'll pet you later. Okay, here we go. You go here, because you're fucking useless after this point. We leave this. And we get both cranks. I kind of feel I, I'll need both. I'm not sure. Light disc, eagle metal. Square crank. Here we go. Square and hexagonal side by side. Maybe I get to finish the game in this session if I don't dick around too much and try not to save. Just for like, look at me, I can beat Resident Evil with minimum saves. Yeah, I bet everyone's just thrilled about that. Like, all the presses. Hippotesla is beating Resident Evil without too many saves. I think that's the news of the day. Fuck everything else that's going on in the world. Green, 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 green. Blue, 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 blue. Okay. Two cranks, shotgun. Is there anything else here? No? Okay, at least I know where it's safe to exist. So let's go to the next room. Are we ready? Ah, fucking snakes! I forgot about them. Ah, more snakes! More snakes! No snakes! Fucking skate snakes. Oh, I forgot about them. I mean, that's why I love it at the same time. Maybe that makes me a... A masochist? I swear there was something there. Because I don't know what's waiting for me. And that makes it interesting. It's not like, yeah, I know what's going to be in this room. In most rooms, I have no idea what's, what I'm going to find. Is there something here? Quickly, Jill, before they jump you. Okay, they're very slow to jump. So, first the safe room, safe room, safe room, whatever. Then the snakes. That's kind of fair. Is there a stone here that will crush me to death? <gasps> I think this is the exit. Dear God, it's the exit. I just miss, I'm just missing one more medal and I'm out of here. Unless they've put like uh, a surprise tyrant up there, be like, yeah, that's what you get. For being cocky, not saving. Ah, oh, yes. The door that never opens, it's welded and does not open. Okay. Then it's pointless. Why is it even in the game? Oh, more herbs. More blue herbs. The herbs that we suddenly appreciate so much. Once we got poisoned to death by the giant... I'm gonna say Snake of Death again, yes. I can eat one of these green ones or smoke them, whatever she does. Roll that shit up, chill. Ooh, that's good, green herb. Okay. And take this one. They're fair with health, at least. It's not like you don't have enough health. It's just that you can't always be quick enough to use it. So I'm gonna return here with one of the medals. Eagle of the East, Wolf of the West. This is the wolf. And where is it pointing? Let me see if it's really like West and East. <laughs> I have no idea. This should be, I guess, West, except the map is like upside down. And I, I'm not sure if this one is oriented properly or this one. Doesn't matter. It's just me nitpicking. A game that I love very much. What's going on? Why is the screen black? I haven't saved. What's going on? Did it fucking freeze on me? Oh. Spider again? Are you fucking kidding me? Oh, this is epic. This is just not... Let me try something. I'm gonna try and... I'm hot anyway, I want to take this sweatshirt off. I'm going to try and just remove the disc and put it back in. Just give me one second. 
I'll be right back. Okay, I believe it's gonna, something was wrong with the disk or the drive, I'm not sure it wouldn't read the disk at all. So, let's go back to the spider, I guess, that's my destiny. It's my Groundhog's Day, actually. Spider Day, whatever. Oh, jeez. This is not how I planned this, but I'm gonna finish it. Why did I not save in this room? I guess it just, I, I was just saying I'm gonna save and then I didn't save and there's a lesson to be learned here, kids. And it's save your game. Save it often. Like the game says, save often. Don't be like me. Don't try to prove something while saying you're not trying to prove anything because you're obviously trying to prove something. <laughs> okay, here we go again. You're once again for the fifth time today enter the world of survival horror. Good luck. I will not forgive those hunters or the spider. Ah, I wonder how will I do as well this time. That was actually a good run. Oh my god, this is deja vu. Oh, I feel like this already happened. Five times today. Yes, Jill, it was it was really scary now. Get up, get ready for a hunter that's gonna jump you. Yes. Slowly get into the crevice. Crevasse. No, it's only crevasse if it's a nice. Flame rounds are mine. Try to hit him with, with everything you got. No, 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 he'll see you. What's wrong with you? He's gonna, I think he's gonna run straight into the bazooka, but I, I'm not sure. Yep, he is. Okay, that was good. That was lucky. Now the spider. I think I know this by now. So as soon as he spits, it spits a few times. Oh. Here we go. Ah, fuck you. Fuck you again. I'm fine, I'm fine. Ah, stop spitting, bitch. Poison and danger, okay. One more explosive and then fire and it's, it's gonna be done. Come on, it's gonna be done. You can do it, Jill. Come on, Jill. Come on, Jill. We've done this five times today. Yeah! Fuck yeah! Fuck you, spider! Uh. Welcome everyone from Small Streamers. As you can see, it stands here. Not poisoned. Fine and dandy. Wait for the little guys to come out. I'll just wait at the door. It's gonna blow up. It's gonna blow them out of its ass. Here they come. Okay. Lots of little spiders. Ooh -wee. Okay. By the time I enter that room again, they're all gone. It's a self cleaning room. Okay, there was uh, an ink ribbon here, right? Yep, yep. Here we go. Ink ribbon. Thanks for the follow, Mr. Keenan. I hope I pronounced that properly. We have the knife. We have the ink ribbon. We're going to save more often. There's nothing to prove here. Not getting anything but not saving. Just gonna get the freezing game and hunters walking away with our heads, which is not something we like to do. Uh, take that, fucking cobweb, blocking the door and whatnot. Okay, okay, okay. The puzzle's closed, so I know where to take the metal. 
There's nothing here. I think there's nothing left here. So let's go to to the safe room. Was it the left? I think it was the left. No snakes for now. Snakes. Oh my god, snakes. It's the sa safe room comes first. Safety first, and then we go fight assholes and tyrants and whatnot. I wonder if those little creatures I never actually had, knew their names, the, the ones that appear in generator room that look like hunters but aren't hunters, I wonder if they're gonna be hard without auto aim. Because that's... I kind of remember they, them being harder in the uh, in the remake, but maybe, maybe I'm just talking out of my ass, I don't know. Yes, take that first aid spray that we're never gonna use because it's beneath... Our ego does not allow us to use this spray gel. It lowers the grade. Which is there just to be like... That's all I have! My Resident Evil grades! That's all that's left. I have nothing. Respect the blue herbs. They're good herbs. As we've seen a few minutes ago. They can save our skin. Isn't that like, isn't that wonderful at the same time, as scary as it is, that just like, just because they removed the auto aim, you're like, because in, in a normal run, you might need the blue herb once, twice. I don't remember using them a lot. But then here, I've almost used up all of them. Everything's trying to poison me. Everything's trying to spit some, some shit my way. Okay. I have... I have a knife. I have two knives now. I have a crank, and I think I'll need the other crank, but fuck it. Fuck it all. I have the herbs with the blue in them in case I get poisoned. Hopefully the game doesn't freeze this time at the same spot, because that is not fair. So I'm gonna save. I'm also gonna bring the... Eagle of the East, Wolf of the West. And what else is there? That's it for now. I'm gonna need some room for the herbs though, so I'm gonna leave I'm gonna leave the, the crank for now. Right next to square crank. And that's it. Save. Leave the ink ribbon. Am I carrying the shotgun? I am. So I wanna fire the bazooka by accident. Where is that? Yeah, save. <laughs> save. Do not fuck around without saving in this version. I can't stress that enough. No checkpoints. No, nothing. Well, it's not bad seven saves this far, but... It's not, it's not bad. There's a lot of ink ribbon left, so... Even if I save at every typewriter I see... Um, till the end of the game, it's still gonna be... There's still, still gonna be plenty of ink ribbon. Did I pick up the ink ribbon? Yeah, I did. I had 16, so... Right? Right. Snakes! Fucking snakes! Snakes, snakes everywhere. No, 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 leave me alone. Snakes, snakes, snakes! Fuck you, snakes. Okay. Hoo-wee! Can't say this isn't a bit uncom uncomfortable. Where did I... Where do I... I think the elevator... Yes! Oh, I... Kind of feel there's a one more boulder trap. Whenever things don't move for a while, I just... I think the game's frozen and I freeze my myself. Huh? So this door is welded and does not open. Well, yeah, of course it does not open if it's welded, chill. Like, God. And there's one green herb we can smoke to get better, because we're currently in yellow. Whee! There you go. Take the other one. Mix one of those. Yeah, there's gonna be a, plenty of space for all the herbs. Okay. I wish I could just pick up all of them. Do you wanna take it? No, I kneeled to a, <laughs> a plant pot, pulled out the herb out of there, and be like, yeah, I'm gonna leave it here. I was just testing it, if it can be even plucked out of the pot, whatever. 
We may have a problem, ladies and gentlemen, because... Oh no, look, did it load? It loaded, okay. So don't make it load two things at once. Okay, eagle. Eagle, fuck you, buddy. You go here. Yeah, it happens, man. Don't worry. Don't worry. Davidson? But this happens too. This is defeating. Like, wow. The whole game worked and it's gonna freeze near the end. That's just... That's not That's not fun at all. That's... That... I'll give it some time. Maybe it's just... I know, I remember back in the uh, in the old days when this would happen in the game room with just like, some people would be like, I'll pay for an hour, here you go, just leave it there and sometimes, miraculously, it will load. So I'm hoping that this happens now. Because it kind of hurts me to get this close to the end and be like, uh, you can't finish the game. But if, it, that is, if that is the case, then we're just going to jump straight to Resident Evil 2. Not gonna waste time on this. Please, would you be so kind as to load the game for me? Kind console? No? Maybe? I mean, the chirping is good. I, I like the chirping, that's okay, but I want to see more. Maybe an image, movement, even the snakes. I don't mind the snakes now. It's looking at me with one green and one blue eye. Like the tiger from the from the mansion. Maybe not bring the, the metals straight there, I don't know. How can it be wrong at the end of the game? That's just so not fair. Can I ask you to push the reset button for me? At least we had a we had a save nearby, so yeah, it's the green button. We just Nephew's helping, nephew's really good. I'm gonna commend him. Yeah, just push it. Yeah, there we go. You're the master of resetting. One more time, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> One more time. But you're not gonna load at all? You loaded perfectly, so fine. Like, 50 hours into the game, you decide not to load? What's that? Some kind of a... Rebellion? Come on, I know you can do it. There we go. Maybe I should do the diagnostic thing. Yeah, I can hear it working, okay. I'm pretty sure, actually I'm 100% sure it's not the laser, it's the, uh, it's the disc, because the laser is almost... almost never been used, so... It has to be the the disc. We gotta be honest. I just got this disc when I decided to stream it, so I have no idea if it's gonna if it has it's gonna just freeze every time near the end of the game, which would be just sad. Got this far, man. Gallons of blood were spilled for nothing. Nothing. I do like hearing that every time I press like load game. Courtyard room. Okay, you have once again entered the world of survival horror. Good luck. That part was played by the Star Fox actors, the announcer from Star Fox. Who does that even? Who announces shit in Star Fox? Was it... Okay, I'm gonna leave the medal for now and just pray like that was a fluke and just do other shit and then just come back at one point and be like, oh, it's working now. Isn't that lovely? Let's find the wolf medal first. That's something we can do, hopefully. Once we avoid all of these snakes snakes everywhere oh god not the snakes ah! they even jump jesus okay no more snakes Whew. now go right unless there's a hunter waiting for me there 
Oh no, it's another boulder. Oh. Is that supposed to make me feel better? Oh, which crank? Which crank? It's the square. So first the boulder. Hexagonal. Okay. First the boulder. Just run, 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 run. Nothing's happening. What the fuck? <laughs> Do I have to touch it? Oh, I have to come all the way here and then run for my life. Wow. Well, that's really good game. I can't even aim where I'm running at. Ah! Run! Run, 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 run! It's gaining speed, Jill! Fuck, fuck, fuck! Okay. Fuck you, boulder. You're not fast enough for me. You don't scare me. I'm just screaming to test you. Yeah? Oh, we get a map right after we finish the fucking level. Wow, that's really helpful. Thank you. What's here? It's a Mero disc. Okay, let's take the Mero disc. I'm gonna bring both cranks because I'm pretty sure I'm gonna need the square one inside. Is there anything left to explore? A whole room. Yeah, it's the, the map's there just to wait. I think it's there just to tell me there's a secret room if you spin that shit. Yeah. Just that one room. <laughs> I'm glad they, they fixed that later, kinda. Okay. Okay. More snakes. I'm sorry. I meant more snakes! Fucking snakes! Ah, I hate snakes! In the game, though. I don't hate them in real life. Let's do as much as we can. Blah, 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 blah. Let's see. The marrow disc goes all the way down where the marrow discs are usually at. And then, wow, I turned around. Okay, then we take both cranks. Cranky cranks. And I have one more space. Okay, I can do this. I can walk that far. Are there gonna be any herbs there? Nah, oh, fuck it. I'm gonna return again. Snakes are just there to scare me. They're just there to be like, look at me, I'm all slittery and jumpy. And I'm here to say, snakes! Fucking snakes! No, not the snakes! Ah, ah, snakes! Stay okay. Okay. Mm, here. No more magically spawning hunters, thank you. So now this this is the one of the dumbest puzzles in the game, honestly. No, not the square one. I meant the yeah, the hex one. So you have to do this three times. You know how the first one we did, she just spin spun it all the way where it needed to be? Well this time she's like, yeah, I'm gonna stop here. And that did nothing. I think there's just a hole in a wall or something. Yeah. You can't go anywhere. Can you? Yeah. There's not even health or anything. Just there to be like, you have to do this two more times. Just like, show us how smart you are. Can you spin the crank three times in a row? And she's doing it so much slower than the first time. Just remember, whatever I'm saying about this game I love it I will always love it it's probably gonna be my favorite Resident Evil always gonna be fighting with two for that place because they're both phenomenal in their own right and it's like Resident Evil 2 is one of the best sequels to a video game ever but there's so much stuff that it's funny now that that is funny now that I'm that I'm a grown man not screaming when I see snakes of course it's just, it deserves some laughter. Oh, that music, I love it. Yeah, well, another dumb puzzle. Whoop, whoop. And there's a hexagonal. So it's just hex, so I don't even need the... Uh, where is this? I think it's over there on the north, but let's check. Not sure, not sure. It's right there, okay. Then I know where to push the thing, right? Just to push it there, okay. 
Cranky, cranky, Jill is cranky. She's causing a fucking earthquake <laughs> by moving that thing. Okay, push the statue. Wow, wow, wow. Is it there? I think it's there. Let's see. Oh, you can't use it here. You're like a few centimeters off. You know, you can't just extend your fucking arm and do it. You can do that while talking all the time. You can do this. I am talking, but when you need to use your hand for real, you can't. Because it's like too far away. It's the 90s video game logic. I think it's it changed the way some of us think. Probably 90 ki 90s kids, but... Yeah. Push, Jill. Push. Could have go. You could have went to school, but now you have to push things. Oh, here we go. Hey, Minotauro. Thanks, man. I appreciate it. People are appreciating me going through this. <laughs> oh, it's even though it says it's the director's cut version, it is not. It's the original one without auto aim. That's why I'm so pissed at it. <laughs> Because for some reason Mixer doesn't have the uh, the original Resident Evil 1 as an option. Oh my god, these books! And now we have the medal from the second Doom book. Okay. Is that all? Yeah? Well, we can hope that it's not gonna... We can hope it's not gonna freeze again at this point at the fountain, because if it does, I'm gonna take a small break and just clean the disc a bit. Who knows what it's been through. So let me save again. So one save, <laughs> one save for half of the game, five sa saves for the re <laughs> for the other 15 minutes. Ah, snakes, snakes! I forgot about the snakes! My god, snakes, no! Ooh-wee, okay. Snake, my god, it's a snake. It's the slithery thing. Okay, fuck the cranks. Thanks for the host team. Okay, square crank, hex crank, two medals. I don't even need this. Fuck it, I have four herbs up there. I'm gonna save again. It pains me to save this many times, but. I can't guarantee it's gonna load again, so no herbs. We're not gonna get stoned this time. Thanks for the sparks, man. I appreciate it. Blue herb. I guess that's all. Let's save again. I'm just gonna close my eyes. Pretend that didn't happen. Okay, okay, okay. I love the beat that it's giving me. Okay, 14 left. If you like this, uh, right after I finish this, Resident Evil 1, which I hope it's gonna be tonight, unless it's it freezes for good. I'm gonna start uh, streaming Resident Evil 2, but it's not gonna be the PlayStation version, that's all I'm gonna say. Ah, snakes again, snakes, snakes, get away, get away, it's snakes, oh my god, oh humanity, snakes, okay. I'm losing my, my snake screaming enthusiasm, it's been too many times. Going up. Haha. <laughs> What was it? Duke Nukem? Yeah, it's Duke Nukem. Zero hour. When you open the elevator, he says, going down. So again, let's OCD this, sh OCD this shit for the third time. The door is welded and does not open. It's like locked and not opening. We have two marijuana 
plants. Marijuana weeds? Well, it is a weed. I'm gonna smoke one. She's feeling fine and dandy. Maybe that's why it's freezing. Maybe she's freezing because I keep getting her stoned. I don't know. So now we've secured the path to the fountain and the only thing that needs to happen is for the fountain to open. So let's pray to God that happens. Otherwise all of this has been for nothing. I mean I can definitely find another another copy of the disc. Maybe even dump it on a hard drive and load it through that, I don't know. No, don't don't do that, dude. Come on. Come on. Okay, thank you. Let's give it a few seconds. Probably hard for it to load all that shit. Is there one screen? There's probably a scratch on where that screen is and that's I wonder if I can even get to the lab, okay. Pray to all the gods you believe in, or whatever deities you like. Let's hope this works this time. Ah. Uh. Was it wolf here? I think... Yeah, it's wolf here. Come on! Come on! Do it! As long as we can hear the Cerberi, should be good. Jinxed it. Fuck. Let's give it a few minutes. I'm gonna take a five minute break here. I'm gonna hope it loads. And I'm gonna clean the disc as well. We had a save really nearby, like it was just a minute ago, so that's cool. And I'll be back with or without Resident Evil 1. So see you in five minutes, folks. I'm sorry folks, but there's no helping it. Uh, I tried cleaning the disc, uh, uh, it loads perfectly, whatever happens up to this point, and I can hear the laser struggling, so there's probably a scratch on a single file, and that's all we get, a lot of frozen. So in light of this, until I find uh, a new copy of Resident Evil 1 disc to finish this game, starting Monday I'm going to be streaming a Alternatively, uh, Mortal Kombat Shaolin Monks and Resident Evil 2. Uh, it's a version of Resident Evil 2 that's never gonna freeze like this, I can promise you that. So I'm gonna be streaming Resident Evil 2 Claire A, Liam B scenario, the one that's supposed to be the, uh, the canon scenario. And um, one day, and then one day we get uh, Mortal Kombat Shaolin Monks with Sasha co-op. Was it co-op campaign? It had a lot of K K's in it, so it's Mortal Kombat co-op. Um, that's gonna start on Monday, and that's about it. You can find me on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter as Hippie Tesla. There's an underscore on Instagram. Hopefully, that's something that I'll be able to avoid soon. Thank you all for watching. Again, I'm sorry for this. There's nothing we can do. I'll see you all next time, and until then. Stay well.